Good morning, everyone. I'm very happy to be here in Mississauga uh, with uh, Karina and Nick Winder. Uh, you don't know this, but we're all gathered here for a garden party for Karina's birthday. So uh, happy birthday, Karina. Uh, it's great to be able to meet with families to talk about our plan to build an economy that works for all Canadians. Je suis très heureux d'être ici pour le lancement du Fonds d'infrastructure pour l'apprentissage et la garde des jeunes enfants qui va améliorer l'accès aux services de garde pour les familles à travers le pays. Il y a deux ans, notre gouvernement a décidé de faire des investissements historiques pour offrir aux familles de tout le pays un accès à des services de garde à 10 dollars par jour. Six provinces and territories have already reached the 10 dollars a day target and fees everywhere else have come down by an average of at least 50%. This means families are now saving hundreds, if not thousands, of dollars a month. This is not just about making life more affordable, it's also about growing our economy. Over the past few years, largely because of our investments in childcare, the rate of women with children under six joining the workforce has skyrocketed. Studies show that for every dollar invested in early childhood education, the broader economy receives between a dollar and a half and almost three dollars in return. So yes, childcare is social policy, but it's also economic policy. And today, we're here to announce that we'll continue investing in our economy, in families, and in educators. On est en train de mettre en place le premier système de garde d'enfants à l'échelle du Canada, et on sait que l'infrastructure est un élément essentiel. We need more childcare spaces so more families can benefit from affordable, high-quality childcare. So today, we're launching the Early Learning and Childcare Infrastructure Fund. This is a $625 million investment over four years that will help early learning and childcare providers renovate, retrofit, and build new not-for-profit and public childcare facilities. Childcare providers and educators are at the forefront of building a Canada-wide system, including delivering on our $10 a day commitment. So I want to thank them for all of their work as we continue to recognize and support their efforts here in Ontario and right across the country. We're focused on delivering results for Canadians, and that must include better access to childcare for families.